and welcome back to another episode of Scout survival and today we are back on the fabulous brand new series that everybody is talking about at the moment um uh, where we explore the brand new updates in minecraft and of course we are joined by uh, panda x let's play Hello. and um yeah so as you can see we are sort of where we were in the last episode if you watched the last episode we sort of explored the mangrove i think we had quite a nice time exploring that and we've sort of immersed ourselves with the new update so far so today we're going to probably see if we can find a cave or something and then i did see a pillager over there so i think um there probably will be a village over there somewhere so probably a good thing to do is to find that um so yeah um i believe our house is probably in that direction somewhere but that's okay we can always go back we didn't really leave that much stuff there anyways obviously our dogs are still there Oh yeah, I forgot to take them. Oh uh, yeah. <laughs> so, uh, we probably will be able to go back. If we just keep going in one direction, which is, which is forward, I think. I think, uh, maybe. Yeah, it's that way for the, yeah. the house. That way for the house. Yeah, um, they used to give you uh, maps in um, Minecraft back in oh, the day when it, you spawned. It, it, yeah, that's, that. that's the bedrock version or console console well i don't think they ever did that for java no they didn't but i think it's quite useful in multiplayer especially because you can see i think you know i don't know um so there's a ravine down here um is this just another water cave it's either a water cave or there's just dead end um yeah another water cave they seem to be filling up all these caves of water i don't understand why mojang fe felt the need to do that because how many people are going to have water-breathing potions? Well, whatever they... Turtle heads, whatever. Right, so... Over here, I think... Just go a little... Just explore in this direction. Um, see some sheep, sugar cane... Oh! So I found a warden... Uh... What was it called? Uh, warden base? Wait, um, did you? Pillar... Oh, uh, sorry, not a warden. <laughs> oh, <laughs> a I was about to, <laughs> say, about to say that was quick. So I need to block this off. This this is going to be really dangerous, actually. Um, you got me excited. Gonna... I found some hay bales, though. Oh, a chest and... Oh, bottles of enchantments. I found a goat horn. Yes! <laughs> a Wait, goat that, that, horn. that's new. <laughs> yes, that is a new update. I'm going to enjoy using that for the rest of the episode and annoy you. <laughs> oh, I, I can hear that. <laughs> I don't even know where you are. and I could just hear it from all over here. I'd really like that update. Oh, look, there's um the pillager capes, whatever they are. What are they called the. Bands? Oh, I, I think I see the pillager thing. Well, I see there's, something. There's hay bales down there as well. Oh no, I'm just really damaged health-wise. They've got crossbows, so that is something to watch out. Oh, okay, this is a ravine. I'm not sure. I don't want to risk going down there. Loads of water caves still. Um. I'm probably going a bit too far away from the base. I should probably go back. It's getting night time. Yeah, I thought I saw the uh, the pillager, but I don't. I can always TP. Yeah, you might as well. Uh, if I can even find it myself now. Um, yeah, there was a chest there. There was basically bottles of enchantments. Um, goat horn. Yeah, all this, all this good stuff that I can't <laughs> see. Well, first come, first serve. <laughs> Oh, there might be some more caves around here. There we go. Yeah, I think I did see some potential caves in this direction. So, yeah, there was basically a chest on the top. And if you go down here, there's some hay bales. Oh, you're about to get attacked, I think. Yep. So it's not hard or anything. We can just go in. Yeah. Sorry, I just went away. What do you mean? The, the itch. The, 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 well, this little tower thing. You could just walk in, right? Yeah, there's no. There was barely any pillagers in there at all. Oh. I suspect there's, there's, there's no the door. door. I'm glad the door. I mean, they're not that difficult to kill. I, I, they are hard when they all come at you at once, though. One of the things you should be wary of. And that's quite an, in. Quite a nice structure. You could make it into a house or something. Yeah, I'm, I'm, gonna, I'm gonna give it better lighting. Yeah. I suppose. Does it mean that pillagers will come back here, or is it? I don't know. 
because it's quite a nice building, you know. Surprise, uh, Mo Mojang, give us all this stuff. So, a cape down here. It's a what? Oh, banner, sorry. Yeah. Um. Oh, here we go. Ah! Oh, I got a Omnius banner. Oh. Oh, yeah. There's Put that in the front. Om Om ominous banner. Oh! <laughs> that was the riskiest jump ever. No, I'll, I'll keep this on me just in case. Uh, sword. So, I'm gonna, should we go back to the bed? Yeah. I was so thinking many. about starting a um a wheat farm somewhere. Yeah. Just because I, I got so much wheat. Do you mean a temporary one? Uh, I mean, I just kind of want wheat just so we can make ourselves bread, and we also got like we were able to make ourselves mud blocks. Oh yeah. This this guy keeps following me, but he's not. Oh, there we go. He's trying to shoot at me, but he took his time. I'm back at the beds. Yeah, you might as well, could you, uh, you might as well TP me when you can because I'm getting shot at. Right, yeah, well, it would be a good place to put a wheat farm because we I, it could just start off as temporary, but if we're gonna like stay in the area, we might, I could just end up being our our main one. Yeah, it could be. I did like the mangrove area though, the um surrounded trees around. Because we when we do the castles, maybe we should use that as like our base sort of thing but then we can always have you know farms around the area we don't need to have everything in one place yeah so maybe like if we find a flat area to do the because there's that flat area where where i was talking about making ourselves like castles but then i, I think i saw another flat area over, over that way. there over there yeah somewhere over there yeah if you see literally across there that looks like there's a flat bit of um earth over there oh okay you're already on it <laughs> <laughs> on the boat. Uh, right, so I'm going to grab some of the stuff. Oh. Probably get some seeds in the chest. Was that just teleport? Oh, no. So I've got a bunch of seeds. Uh, I need nine, actually. Have you got all the seeds? Yeah, I've got back a stack. Because every time I go past seeds, I'm just destroying them. Anytime I'm going past grass, sorry. Hmm. I thought I saw like a more flat land. That's, that's kind of a flat land. What's that tree? I found a weird looking tree. I don't know if that's anything to do with an update. Should I just start the uh, the farm when I, when I see there's... Well, should I just start it anywhere that's like got flat enough land? Yeah. Um, is that the bit we mentioned or is it... Uh, well, I just saw some land that's pretty much flat enough. Should I have some wood with me? I don't know why I left a bunch of wood in the chest. Uh, oh. Yeah, that looks pretty flat. If you know oh, yeah. where the direction is, yeah, yeah, because I don't know where we are. We're over there. Yeah, down there. That's the tree I was talking about. So great, great big, big desert biome over here. It probably would mean there'd be a um, desert temple somewhere. Dear, as far as the eye can see is just oh, <laughs> he says and finds one literally immediately. I found a desert temple. So I'm just going to have a little look in it, because I can't resist the urge not to. I would join you, but I don't know if there's anything... I mean, we've all been to... I feel like we've all been to desert temples at this point. Yeah, I mean, it's just really... Oh, I found a village as well. Ooh. So we could go there after. I'm not going to go to the village. I don't want to... I'll, I'll wait for you to come, but um, this could be something we could go in another episode. Um, yeah, the only reason I'm going to the Desert Temple is just for the chest. Really, the chests do not stand on the pressure plate. So, I'll take the TNT with... Why, why don't I? Might as well. So, let's chuck away some of this stuff. We don't need that. Yeah, you can teleport me to you if you want, just so we can go to the village. Yeah. I realise oh, chests crops... are awful. Don't Ooh. really grow unless you're like on the same chunk as, as them. Um, I think so. That's a bit a bit of an annoying thing. I mean, I suppose like maybe before we record, someone can just stand over here. Just... Yeah. So I've actually found some really good stuff. I found a saddle um, for a horse. Uh, obviously, um, I found 
a fire aspect 2, which I think is pretty good. And then a bunch of rotten flesh. Probably not that good. Got some bones. I'm not sure if we need them. So I'll TP. Do you want me to TP you now? Or? Yeah. Hey, hello? Yeah, yeah. Wait, can you hear me? Yeah, I didn't hear you say reply. Yeah, oh, there's not... Uh, there's, literally, uh, all there was was um, fire aspect 2 and a saddle. Okay, guys. So um, we, this is the village over here. Um, just to leave the episode on a bit of a cliffhanger, we are going to end it here. In the next episode, we will explore... Ooh, a very good cave, perhaps. Uh, I bet it's going to be like a dead end. I think that looks like quite a promising cave, actually. Oh, that's, that's... I thought that was lava. It's like those weird glowing vine things. That's copper. Oh, yeah. And, oh, is that ravine? Is it a dead end? There's, uh, oh, no, there's more. There's more cave, different... Different Ooh. accesses to different caves. Different routes. Okay, so this looks promising, and we've got a village to explore as well in the next episode. But um, apart from that, I hope you enjoy this episode, and in the next episode, we'll uh, explore some more uh, exciting things. So uh, thank you very much for watching. This has been Scout Survival, and we'll see you in the next episode. Bye. Goodbye.